Mikey Pretty is only nine years old, but he's already been tipped for great things. He's been playing blind football since he was seven. His dream is to be in the England squad. And last week, Mikey, who's from Enfield, received the Young Achiever Award at the Pride of Britain Sports Awards. And I'm very happy to say that Mikey and his dad, John, join me now. Mikey, the award is hello, it's right here. Congratulations. Thank you. How does it feel to get the to get this award? Well, I was really happy because I didn't actually know what that I won it and then I got told in a month before. Oh, yeah. Oh. So you had to act surprised on yeah. the night then, did you? <laughs> David Seaman gave it to you, didn't he? Yeah. That's pretty special because you're an Arsenal fan, aren't you? Yeah, I am. Yeah. What did he say to you? He just said to carry on what I'm doing and that he's jealous on my ponytail because he used to have one. Oh, yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, I can see. I'm checking out your ponytail. Very good. Listen, let's talk about blind football. Now, you brought in some little things here that you can explain. Can you explain to me how it all works? How do you use this? I'm going to, Dad can help you. There you go. There you go. Tell me what you use that for. So the mask is just in case if people could, if some don't face them through shadows, it's mm -hmm. just to make it fair. Yeah. So they double check. So it's all fair so no one can see the ball. That makes sense. So I could play it if I like if I put that blind foot yeah. on, yeah? And the football? Ah! It's got ball bearings. So the players can hear because they can't see it. Because they have the blindfold on. Yeah. So they hear the ball. It has ball bearings inside. Okay, look. I, watch, I think we're seeing some of you in action there, aren't we? <coughs> oh yes, that's how it all works. Um, John, talk to me a second about the condition uh, that Mikey had. Now it was rod cone dystrophy, and that's very rare, isn't it? And what happened, because he just went for a regular eye test, didn't he, when he was six. It looks as though, what they say? So he went for a regular, well, we took him for a regular eye test, mm -hmm. um, but not because we'd noticed anything mm -hmm. wrong with him. It was literally just a random eye test that any parent would do for their mm -hmm. child. and. Soon after that, well, in that original test, they noticed something not quite right. Yeah. And a few months later, he was diagnosed with a, a rare incurable mm. eye disease, which is rod cone dystrophy. Mm. And um, even at that diagnosis of rod cone dystrophy, he was mm. still fully sighted. So yeah. you can imagine our kind of shock and disbelief that he would go blind because that's what he's got well, to stop you're us. doing so much to raise awareness, aren't you? Yeah. Um, but I've got to ask you, Mikey, that. And um, since because we did speak to you a while ago, didn't we? You've met AJ, haven't you? Yeah. Quite recently. He had a great weekend, didn't he? Did you watch the fight on Saturday? No. Well, you I didn't saw my rematch. Maybe it's a bit day. grown up for you, but listen, yes, there you are meeting him. Just tell us what he was saying to you there. He said to um you don't have to have vision, you can just walk this way. He told me to never give up. Oh. <coughs> He's brilliant, yeah. isn't he? And I know that your big ambition is to play for England, isn't yeah. it, one day? And also to see if they've Arsenal. <gasps> yeah. Um, very quickly, almost out of time. How do you make of Arsenal's performance lately? Well, not good. Oh, but we won. We won we'll Monday. I think. <laughs> I think my that's probably enough said, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Mikey John. Thank you so much for coming in to talk to me. Congratulations okay. on your prize. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye.